Let's head over to the men now looking for a win. They're in ninth place in the conference. Only the eight teams get to go in and watch this. An alley-oop attempt just missed by Perry Francois. He's gonna get a little revenge of his own right there. Surrounded in the paint, gonna get the hook shot to go. Now he's gonna kick it out. Miles Smith, a three, nothing but the bottom. Islanders win on homecoming. Final score, 78 to 70. We've not been able to talk this about hockey this much at all this season. Sadly, the ice race season is close to its end. But I think one thing personally we take for granted is how talented these players are playing a sport on skates and hitting a puck with finesse and power. Take a look. It's one of those recognizable sounds. The slap shot in hockey, a sheer display of power as players shoot a puck upwards of 100 miles per hour and then some. But it's not just a wind up and a hit as hard as you can. Like everything in hockey, it takes technique. When you're taking a slap shot, you actually want to touch the ice before you touch the puck. The minute you touch the ice with a stick before you touch the puck, that's when your stick wants to bend. The whip out of that bend is what, what triggers your strength and your speed on your shot. Just like a batter swinging a bat in baseball, you have to find that perfect spot. And you have to get it like right in a, in a the sweet spot in the middle of the blade. And like a batter hitting a home run, the shot feels smooth and effortless. You can feel like when you, especially with like one timers, you can feel if it comes off your blade smooth. On the other end of each puck shot at triple digit speeds is the goal tip, watching that puck fly towards him. It's definitely tough. I think what a lot of people uh, don't know is that most of the goaltending is, is mental. There's no time to be scared. At the end of the day, you can't really be afraid of the 100 mile an hour puck. You gotta be afraid of letting it in. If you flinch, it's in the back of the net. It's a battle between shooter and net minder. And a slick glove save calls for celebration. Goalies don't really get to celebrate, so when you get to make a nice glove save, it feels good. And for those playing together, sometimes they like to see who can shoot the hardest. I definitely feel like I have a pretty good slap shot, and that's something I take pride in, I guess. Yeah, ice skating's hard. Think about playing hockey or a sport on ice skates. I can't do it. Well, stay with us.